the year 2021, EOS ESCO designated into a national year of creative economy for sustainable development and global recovery. Despite the difficulties and hardship brought about upon by the COVID-19 pandemic, creativity could help in healing and transformation. The scope of the toolkit is not only for the province of Marinduque or the region of Mimaropa, but the digital, online, and virtual world. Good day to everyone. I am Randy Noblesa from the island province of Marinduque. I am the Marinduque State College Culture and Arts uh, Unit Head. So let me share my slide. for today's uh, presentation. So the paper that I am about to share is entitled MSCC, a learning toolkit for regional and global development during the new normal era. So I divided the paper accordingly. Introduction, uh, materials and methods, results and discussion, conclusion, and I also included an, an acknowledgement. So the year 2021 is also uh, the celebration of quincentennial uh, of the battle in Mactan in Cebu and also the beginnings of Christianity in the archipelago. So the materials and methods for this uh, paper are the following. So this is the compilation of CD uh, of audio recordings, including Obrang Sining, Katang Isip, and Saling Awit, Saling Tula. Likewise, it is included in the learning toolkit are the uh, video recordings and a DVD which includes Ciclam Society, e-performance, and the webinar talk series, Cine Marinduque and Tanghal Marinduque. Also included in the materials is the printed uh, booklets of the History of Marinduque excerpts and the literary folio Malikhain and Balangaw. And also the uh, history book of Francisco Labay entitled Cuento ni Lolo Kiko. And finally, uh, we also have a couple of uh, student uh, output, which is hardbound uh, copies of uh, Pecha Kucha Marindo Quezon, 400 heritage items of Quezon, and Pecha Kucha Marindo Quezon, 100 heritage items of Marindo so in celebration of uh, the quincentennial, so last April, we just had the National Literature uh, Month celebration and the Filipino Food Month as well. So here are the details of the results and uh, discussion. So Obrang Sining Katang Isip is the brainchild of Oscar Loreto, a folk art and a musician, compositor, who recorded the, the original compositions like Tinig sa Pulo, Lalawigan, Daang Paraiso, and uh, Tagaytay. Also included are uh, Tuba and uh, a new rendition of Juban Magyaya uh, version of Marinduque March. So Saling Awit, Saling Tula are a combination of folk songs from the town of Gasan and spoken word poetry from the book of Joseph uh, Sagid. So we selected five folk songs entitled Alamat ng Dalawang Puting Gansa, Dalagang Parang, Isang Buong Dayap, Lahat ng Bagay, and Sulong Aking Tandang. And in the spoken word uh, poetry from the anthology of Joseph uh, de Luna Sagid are the following. Kung paano pa maari maunawaan ang Diyos, Unang gabi, tanawin, anting bulating, and biglang awa. And we also included some excerpts of the uh, Passion uh, play recited orally by practitioners in the lowland uh, Christianized uh, 
areas in southern Tagalog and other places in the Philippines. So that was the audio recordings and we move on to the uh, video uh, recordings. So we have a couple of this. So Sini Marinduque was a talk series which uh, assembled local filmmakers like Joseph Israel Laban, uh, Asa Lakdaw, and Raisa Masculino. And uh, Tanghal Marinduque is a combination of different uh, playwright, directors, and thespians like Danny Ledesma Mandia, Brian Viray, and Rexandro Nicomoseno. So this project was uh, uh, funded by the Cultural Center of the Philippines. And one of our centennial project on local history, we were able to compile the cultural history of Perfecto Mirapuente and the history of Marinduque by Ramon Madrigal. So we just selected some portions of the two volume history of Marinduque books. And we also have a couple of literary folio from the creative writing class that uh, we had uh, between 2009 and 2019. So this was produced by our resident uh, literary organization, Literary Club, and our uh, AB English uh, Society. So the other uh, compilation is uh, Balangaw, so it's named after the Old Tagalog for Rainbow. And uh, to uh, conclude the section, we also included the local history book of Francisco Labay. So Lolo Kiko is the uh, endearment for Francisco Labay. So he talks about Battle of Pai and Battle of Pulang Lupa, two among the Filipino-American battles during the 1900s. And finally, we also have a couple of compilations from our graduate students who were, who were tasked to collect um, iconic items from Marinduque. So in honor of the centennial of Marinduque in 2020, we selected 100 heritage items. And likewise, in celebration of the quadricentennial of the Pueblo de Tayabas in Quezon, we also included 400 heritage items in Quezon. And by way of conclusion, uh, we were able to come up with the MCCA Learning Toolkit and we launched it last uh, April and through and through until uh, May, the National Heritage Month. So to sum up, so the implications for regional and local development. So we had this uh, summary of the format in CD and DVD, booklet and hardbound. So the contents as follows, a couple of audio recordings, a couple of uh, webinars, uh, two history uh, booklets and two uh, literary folio, and a couple of uh, anthology from our graduate uh, students. So this has bearing with our locality in Marinduque and other Tagalog speaking provinces uh, with the new normal platform uh, we use archive.org for digital reproduction. So we also have uh, a national uh, impact to the country and uh, we hope that uh, we could also reach the, the region, our ASEAN counterparts. So we also uploaded this in archive.org and we had a live stream in, via YouTube and Facebook Live. And uh, our booklets uh, could reach the global uh, through online, virtual, and digital means using ESO.com and the uh, Institute of Creative Writing. So they have an uh, online uh, library called Prilipiniana, and it is published in their 
uh, official website, panitikan.ph, and the uh, hardbound copies of our Marinduquezon Pecha Kucha could also reach uh, Mimaropa and Calabarzon. So Marinduque used to be part of Quezon and Tayabas was its former name. And of course, it has bearing to Marinduque and Quezon. And it is uh, published in msc.marinduque.edu.ph in our virtual creative hub. And to end uh, this presentation, I'd like to thank, of course, Akupe for the opportunity to share this with you. And the uh, MSCCA unit, which is under the Auxiliary Service of Marinduque State College, and also the uh, production in the Business and Affairs Office, uh, to the Mimaropa Commission on Higher Education, to the Department of Education, to our Performing Arts Group, Sea Club Society, and Literary Club, our literary organization, and uh, the ICW website, panitikan.ph, and also for the endowment from the Cultural Center of the Philippines and the National Commission for Culture and, and the Arts. And we'd also like to show deep appreciation to Francisco Labay and Joseph Sagid, and also to the graduate students of the Quezonian Educational College Incorporated and the MS School of Graduate Education Professional Studies, along with the uh, internal funding from the MSc Research Development Extension and Training, for without this, it, uh, the project would have not been completed. So on that note, uh, thank you and keep safe everyone.